I took this video in slow-mo on my iPad and it's really really slow and I even s actually sped it up one and a half times in this video editing tool but even though it's really slow either way this illustrates the morning view you get when you're hanging out on the boat uh, so we're anchored in uh, Richardson Bay right off Sausalito to the far right Sausalito to the far left is uh, Belvedere uh, that building to the right of the picture is the Sausalito Yacht Club. Um, where the anchor's up and we're motoring out really slowly, and so you can barely tell the motion here. But this view, how the sun reflects on the water, um, there's a channel marker there in the water, and right above it, right now, is Salesforce Tower in the city of San Francisco. Um, a little bit to the left, you can see Alcatraz behind that anchored boat. And further behind Alcatraz, uh, you can see Treasure Island uh, uh, and the San Francisco Oakland Bay Bridge. Um, moving to the left of the picture, that's Angel Island. That big mountain over there is Angel Island. And um, just Becky and I enjoy our coffee and tea in the morning, taking in this view. So when we left this morning, we didn't get to Bodega Bay until after dark, partly because we just hung out here and took it all in. So we love stuff like this. Uh, enjoy, it'll be over soon, and uh, watch for whales in just a little bit.
got to Bodega Bay, it was after dark, and Becky on the bow with a flashlight, we navigated through this very narrow channel. And at the time we got there, it was uh, low tide, and so this channel is dredged out. The bay itself is at low, to at low tide, you can pretty much walk across it. It's uh, uh, The bottom was actually sticking out. I mean, it was a negative tide when we got there. So we navigated all the way back here off the restaurant called Fishetaria and straight ahead here is in at the tide. So this is our departure during the day, the morning. Uh, Becky's bringing up the anchor. It's got a little mud on it, so she gets a little water to wash it off. Um, we don't like carrying mud. And um, so this is our long, slow navigation out of the anchorage area. Uh, there's two marinas here in Bodega Bay, Spud Point, and I forget the name of the other one, but they were both full uh, state of California delayed crab season for commercial. So the commercial guys were in there waiting for crab season to open. Bodega uh, uh, Emerald Sea is kind of wide and long, so they're taking up all this. We, we, we just can't park Emerald Sea anywhere, so we had to come all the way back here no, to this right, um, right, the button away. The button away. Anchorage area to, uh, to stay, which was nice. We liked it. It was close to take the dinghy in to visit lots of restaurants. We went to the Birds for oysters. We went to Spud um, Restaurant, Spud's Restaurant, Asking Becky for a, be a wonderful crab sandwich. We had great fish and chips, great chowder again at Spud's, so it was nice to dine around here for the next few days. up here in a little bit the guy off this fishing boat will shout at us nice boat and uh so emerald sea gets a lot of kudos wherever we go i told him he had a nice boat too but he said his was a lot of work Those these guys in the boat right there clean up anything that falls in. Yeah, they're probably... looking for floaties, and they. Uh, I think they're. Oh, they're looking for 
looks like they're doing engine repair right now. Oh, ooh, oopsie, yeah. The guy in the front, though, he's got his net working. Once, one time we went by, they looked like they're teenagers. So oh, uh, yeah, they're probably. They did a good job. Well, hey, guys. In those days, all the pilings were creosote, and creosote is bad these days. Yeah. Soaked in creosote, huh? Nice. So I like navigating these waters much more in the dark or in the daylight. Yeah. My life or your sleep, sorry. Actually, it was only like seven o'clock at night. It was just pitch dark. Where's that house that burned? Oh, we did? Oh, okay. Didn't realize we were that close to it. All the birds up on the pipe, up on the uh, gym marker. Oh no, where's our little marina on the other side? The old marina's here. Just on the other side of this little seawall. there. 
we're heading out to Crab. We need to watch for crab nuts when we get out here. Yeah, these two have probably been out and coming back in, huh? Oh, and they want to go down this channel. Well, that's nice of them to wait for us. Instead of cutting us off. I guess up there on the hill. I was thinking it was a house, but it looks like it's maybe um, apartments. And we went in that marina. So I read on Facebook this morning commercial crab season has been delayed oh, again. Really? So private folks can crab, but commercial can't crab. So we might not see crab nets because the whales are still here. They don't want oh. the whales getting tangled up in the crab nets. Oh. Oh good, I hope we you get to see that. We still need to them. watch because I'm pretty sure there's some nets out there that yeah. people forgot. Yeah. But, uh... Huh. Oh, I hope we see some whales. They should be heading down to Mexico, shouldn't they? go with us. Maybe. This is the time of year that they go down with their babies, right? I think they know. They go down to Maine in the warm water and then they cross oh. down there and then they bring them up here in the spring. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. And they eat and forge themselves off Alaska with all the salmon.
ruffles right straight ahead. Oh, oh my god. He's right there. That must have been where he came up before. What are those behind him? I know. I think that's a dolphin. Well, there's definitely dolphins right there. Oh yeah, look at them. They're all just swimming with them. Come back up, kids. I know. Now that I have my camera, there There's some. There they are. <laughs> that's awesome. Those are sea, sea otters. Are they? Yeah. Oh, like ten of them. Come back. All right. I heard a big. Maybe he's going way down. I heard a big breath right over there, and it was a big whale breach taking a breath, and and he's gone. There he is. spout. Of course I don't get a tail slap, darn it. Come back up, Jumbo. 